Seven. <laughs> Y'all, for Sam's gas is three dollars and eighty nine cents, and your girl is filling up. I had a half a tank of gas, but when I was here last weekend, I noticed that there was three eighty nine. So I was like, let me see if it's still three eighty nine, and if so, I'm about to fill up. We are already at like thirty three dollars, thirty three. Come on, y'all can stop at 40, shit. It took $38, so. I put $69 like three days ago. But I do drive a lot. And especially with Isaac's car being in the shop, like I'm so annoyed with that. We had it towed to this place because the tow truck driver who came said that the vehicle, um, that he had a repair shop. Sir, you need to go. Um, had a repair shop and it took him two days to even like check the vehicle to tell me what was wrong. And then he was like, I can give you a price tomorrow. I was like, no, thank you. I was like, I don't have this kind of time where it takes 48 hours to just tell me what's wrong with it. And then you're going to tell me in another two days how much it's going to cost. That's four days wasted. And he was like, well, I have a lot of cars. Well, you should have told me that before you wanted to take the car there. What did you think I was going to do? Leave it there for a month? No. No. So most mechanics are closed on the weekend. So now we have to figure out on Monday, I know where to take it. Where I took my Durango to get fixed, um, but it's just so far from where we moved to. It was literally down the street from where we used to live, but now it's like 30 minutes away. So yeah, anyways, I drive a lot, so I use a lot of gas. Now let's go to the game. And now we are here, I'm starving, I'm so hungry. But we're gonna eat after because we have like a five hour window in between the next thing. So that's why I'm gonna keep on. And we gonna eat. And we gonna eat good. So I just want y'all to look at my kid. Oh, she just woke up. Oh, she's going back to sleep. Oh. Rain is knocked out. We are in Family Dollar. I came to coupon in between games and she peed on herself <laughs> oh my god i need to go down the dollar aisle i need like i don't want to buy a whole pack of pull-ups like oh <gasps> i have a pull-up in my car yes i just thought about that i forgot i brought a set of clothes but she peed on herself on the way here she fell asleep and i thought she had a pull-up on but she took it off so she took it off before we left home because she just wanted to wear panties and I didn't know that and I got a little surprise. So I already used the change of clothes that I had. Now I got to try to find some shorts for her to put on because we still have like five more hours down here. Oh, look, they got clearance underwear. These are $2. I'll just grab some of these. Are these really clearance? Extremely me bikini size four yep we're gonna get these for two dollars our fingers are crossed but i think i have a pull-up in here i think i have a pull-up i think i have a pull-up <gasps> booyah i knew i had put two pull-ups in here a while back and one day i seen it and i was like this is gonna be for emergencies look at god oh my gosh y'all so i went into this little convenience store because i've been trying to cash in this lottery ticket i've had it for literally like three weeks if not longer and I keep forgetting it. So I never buy these, but <laughs> L buys them every now and then. I'm not gonna say every now and then, he buys them a lot. But I never went, but I won on that ticket. So I was like, ah, oh, I just left it on the counter. Anyways, I went in there to go um, cash it in and buy me a Pepsi. And my damn sunglasses fell off underneath the cooler, underneath where I couldn't reach it. So I was trying to fish it out with a Slim Jim. 
And then this, the lady that worked there, she ended up getting them. But how the hell did my sunglasses fall off in the weirdest spot? And then I felt so awkward because I was like, is there anybody working in the back? And she was like, no. I felt like I was asking questions if somebody was getting ready to like rob the store or something. I was like, let me just shut up and I'm going to stay over here with this lady. So if she does get my sunglasses, I'm going to be right there with her. <laughs> but it was weird. But she was really nice. But I felt like, oh my gosh, I'm asking like really weird questions. But I got my sunglasses back. And then I bought two more lotteries. All right, guys. So now me and Rain still have two hours. And we managed to GPS. Oh, look. Children's Place. I could just go in there and buy her some clothes. But just like probably six minutes away from where the games are. Guess what okay, I got. Hey, y'all. Look, Rain. Guess where we are. Charlie's. I am obsessed with this place lately. I don't know why. I just think. And I was so happy that we found one so close because the other one is 40 minutes away. That's what you get. <laughs> Maybe you'll stop. A hard head, make a soft ass. Yes, please. Of course, no cheese on mine, but I don't know why lately. I have just been obsessed with this. Well, I lost on one lottery ticket, but one on another one. Ooh. And these were $5 tickets, and I cashed in a $10 ticket. And guess what? I won more. I done. Then $10, which means that I want my money back. And some. And so Hey, <laughs> No music plan. We're back at the gym waiting. This is literally what life is for me from April to August. Every year, every weekend. <laughs> that game was crazy. They lost by four. They were tied pretty much the whole game or either up by one. Sorry, got an email. But anyways, it's like 1130. We just got home and I'm so tired. But thankfully, I love basketball and I love being a basketball mom, but I'm tired. <laughs> With all this driving, it literally wears you out. And like, oh, I'm just dreading because Isaac's car is still not fixed. So I still have to pick him up from work. So it puts me at getting home later and it's just exhausting but it's part of motherhood so anyways i'm going to bed i have to be up at 6 a.m for another tournament and gotta drive back to tampa i know you guys are probably like why don't you just stay but whether the money that i spend on a hotel would cost the same well, since gas prices are like so much expensive now, it kind of evens out. Cause I spent thirty today on gas, but I filled up the other day for sixty nine. But the gas that I put today, like say I didn't have any gas, it would have cost me like seventy dollars to fill up, and then I drive there and back and drive again. It will probably be like a hundred dollars for gas for the two days. Plus what I spent on wristbands and <coughs> it would still cost me more um, for a hotel. And then I just really like coming home and staying in my own bed. I don't mind the drive, but this week and last week, like last week they played one game on Saturday this week they played two games and that's what's tiring when the tournaments it's two games and then that gap oh my gosh if they would have played back to back that would have been wonderful but I'm so tired and now yeah AAU life but it's gonna be my last year last summer with AAU because Ava graduates next year so this will be her last year so I know I'll be sad when it's over but anyways I'm going to bed. I'll see y'all tomorrow.
but first let me show y'all this show i've already watched it but i'm watching it again because it's that good <clears throat> i don't remember watching season two but i'm starting it over before i go to sleep and it's morning lt's asleep or well, he's not asleep but i'm leaving and he's staying and i'm sleepy and he gets to sleep but he also has rain <laughs> bye babe <clears throat> i'm not taking rain you know, because i just want to get in and out in and out in, mm -hmm. in and out oh look here's my ticket he didn't believe how much I won on my ticket yesterday. Mm -hmm. I want you to apologize when I show you this ticket. Thank you very much. I told him how much I won. It don't take that long to look at it. It do. Y'all know one time he won $500 on the lottery ticket. And he, as soon as he, he took, didn't you take a picture of it and send it to me? Yeah, I think so. I know he came home and broke bread with me. I know that. He gave me half. I was like, that was sweet. Okay, I'm going to go cash it in when I get back over there. <laughs> I didn't win on the other one. <clears throat> You proud of me? You know I never buy these. <laughs> I only want fifteen dollars. I told him I want five hundred. <laughs> he was like, "If you would have won five hundred dollars, you would have been calling me and texting me the ticket." A win is a win. Y'all, this was a trip from hell. First off, we were doing so good with time, and then I missed my exit looking see and i stopped having the lady talk to me in my ear because sometimes i'll be aggravated and i don't be wanting her to talk to me because she talks too much you know on the gps and y'all know i'm new to florida so i don't know my way around like i literally gps everywhere i don't care if Elle tells me like you remember when we went uh-huh i remember what's the address <laughs> so um Anyways, I missed my exit, and the bad thing about missing that particular exit, because this is our first time coming here, we played at a different location yesterday, you had to, you couldn't exit again, so it took me 30 minutes out the way. We literally got here two minutes before the game started. I don't know if they were running behind, but still. So I dropped Ava off, but this is the thing. So every day, I get a Pepsi, and yesterday at the 7-Eleven, the Pepsi was out, so I got Coke. No problem. I'll drink Coke. I just prefer Pepsi. Let me tell y'all something. I The Coke was working yesterday. So then today, same thing happened. So I ended up getting a Coke. So I didn't drink it because I'm like, oh, it's good. Man, why I got in the car and the damn Coke was like, just, it was no carbonation. Like, y'all hear that? Oh my God. I just, I just literally tried to let y'all hear it and poured it. Oh my God. That's a fizz. Okay. So needless to say, we didn't stop. I drove all the way here with no caffeine. Literally none. No caffeine. Y'all don't understand. I'm sure you do understand for all my coffee drinkers out there. I'm not really a coffee drinker. <clears throat> I'm a soda drinker, but I will drink um, like fraps. No problem. I'll drink iced coffee. Like we have an iced coffee maker at home. We got the care. We got a lot of iced coffee stuff. But I'm just a Coke person, like soda person. Oh my God. Y'all ever seen Intervention? And y'all know when them people, like they be addicted to drugs and then their family try to help them and get them off. But then they get that crack pipe or whatever you call it. And they take their first hit. 
That's what this feel like. I ain't never done crack. I'm just telling y'all. I don't. I watched Intervention way too much to ever. I'm like, I will never want to be like that. Those people be like bad. But I do understand, like, because trust me, everybody got somebody in their family um, that had an issue like that. But anyways, I always say that I don't know what it's like to do crack. But when you get that first hit of your Pepsi in the morning, it's, mm -mm. it's so good. But anyways, so uh, excuse, did I just burp on camera? I'm sorry. Excuse me. Y'all, I was reading y'all's comments about Rain peeing on herself in the family dollar. And they were like, you just didn't skip a beat. I should be in there watching the Avis game. But when you see them all, see them all, you see them all. Plus, this other team just walked out, so I don't think they started it. I'm about to go in there, though. Um, <clears throat> and people were like, oh, you didn't skip a beat. Like, you were, like, just so calm about it. I'm really that mom. Shit happens. Like, hmm. She peed on herself. No biggie. We need clean up on aisle four. If you give me the mop, I'll clean up my child's piss. Rain has pooped on herself at a basketball game. But these are things that are all my fault. Like, had I just left her in a pull-up, that wouldn't happen. And then when I pick her up from daycare and we would go to Ava's high school games, she always wears pennies to daycare. So I would forget to tell them to put her on a pull-up because... I, she's when we go to these games she's so excited to be at the games and like I will ask her Rain you got a potty no Rain literally pooped and I didn't have another set of clothes nothing I was like oh my god it was bad but I like she shit everywhere like it was crazy I had to like put my jacket on her clean her in the bathroom with whatever I had I don't know what I had in my purse I might have had a pull up in my purse. I don't know, or something. I don't know. But I ended up taking my jacket off and putting my jacket on her, and that was her shirt. And I'm like, I seen one of my parent friend moms from the AAU team, because her daughter played at that school we were playing at a high school. And I was like, my kid just shit her pants. And she was like, girl, we all know, we all been there. I'm like, yeah. But I never get mad at my kids for that. Never. Like, I'm that mom that, like, I don't like spanking my kids. Like, I just like look at them. But anyways, yeah. All right, on to other things now that I got this Pepsi in my body. So I cashed in my lottery ticket. L told me, he was like, I was like, should I just get my $15? Like, what should I do? And he was like, well, you started with 10. He was like, so buy two more and keep the five. So I bought two more. So I'm going to scratch these and we'll see what happens. And then I'm going into the game. I'll, I can make it to my thumbnail. I think I am going to make this. Yeah. And that's a wrap, friends. So they won that game 43 to 44. That was a good game. Um, Ava did really well. I didn't record a lot um, that game. Normally I do, but I didn't film. Um, I just, I'm tired. So, anyways, um, yeah, she. Then we had to come back to the other location where we played at yesterday because they were gonna take team pictures. Um, I've been back. I went. I dropped her off, and then I went to go fill my tank up again. I went back to Sam's. I should have got gas where we were earlier because it was three eighty five. And so right now, back at Sam's, I paid three eighty nine, but it's okay. So. With that being said, I'm just waiting for her to tell me that they're ready so we can go home and your girl is going to bed. I have to take a nap before I go couponing. Like, it is what it is. But anyways, thank y'all so much for watching. I love you too when you're back and I'll see you in my next video. Bye.